This is an overview of the DQE standard decontamination shower system, including key features, as well as the assembly process. The standard decontamination shower is portable, assembles quickly, and is easy to use. The shower configures to accommodate standing, sitting, and even non-ambulatory individuals. First, let's cover the shower system's components. The standard decon shower is available separately or as a part of a system with elevation grids and a four foot by eight foot collection pool. The standard shower is compatible with a variety of DQE pools, such as the compact collection pool, disposable collection pool, and the flexible containment pool. To assemble the standard decontamination shower system, let's start with the collection pool. Use the carry handles to place the collection pool in a suitable location within your designated decontamination area. Unfold the pool and use the pin to lock the side rail into position. Place the elevation grids into the pool as shown, noting the orientation of the grids. These elevation grids allow an individual walking through the decontamination process to stand above the collected water. Next, let's assemble the shower. Remove the top and bottom U-base pieces from the carry bag. These parts interlock for compact, convenient storage. Unclamp the quick connect fittings and place the parts next to the pool. Each U-base piece is marked with either red or blue tape. Blue tape designates parts for the bottom of the shower and red designates parts for the top of the shower. This is easily remembered by the phrase blue bottom, red roof. Connect the bottom U-bases with the extenders, securing the quick connect fittings. Place this bottom assembly into the collection pool. Now, remove the upright pieces from the bags and connect them to the bottom assembly. Place the upright with the on-off valves on the side of the pool where water will be supplied. To build the upper assembly, connect the top U-bases and their extenders by securing the quick connect fittings. Take this upper assembly, marked red for roof, and position the assembled top onto the shower unit. As an alternative, the shower can be leaned over while a second person connects the upper assembly. To add privacy, you can now place the vinyl shower enclosure onto the shower. Unroll the enclosure's curtain and lock into the desired configuration. The flaps allow for full privacy or partial privacy options for medical staff or first responders to monitor decontaminating individuals accordingly, including through the mesh window. Anchor straps along the bottom of the enclosure allow it to be secured to the pool during windy conditions. The enclosure includes a white panel on the roof to allow light into the shower. This completes the assembly of the shower. Now, simply connect a standard water hose and ensure the water source valve is open. The valves allow for a variety of water flow options. You can supply water to just the shower, the shower and the handheld sprayer, or just the handheld sprayer, which provides a quick and easy solution for non-ambulatory decontamination. Allow several seconds for the water to fill the pipes. Multiple spray nozzles provide complete coverage to ensure fast and thorough decon. Disassembly is essentially the assembly process in reverse. After the components are disassembled, arrange the top and bottom parts to form an interlocked unit as shown. Then, take the carry bag and place over the unit, then roll over. Place the other components into the center of the bag. These heavy-duty vinyl bags have drainage holes to provide dry storage and easy transport. As you can see, the standard decontamination shower system is very portable, assembles in just minutes, and is easy to use. The built-in features create a flexible decontamination solution for situations involving one to several individuals. Visit dqeready.com backslash decon to view the full line of DQE decontamination showers.